Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and to another video. If you are new to my channel, my name is Rosina and I create makeup, lifestyle, bit of everything on this channel. I am also over on TikTok, so I do a couple of days on here, I do three days a week on here, and I do the rest of my time over on TikTok, so welcome. Today I thought I would do another one in my series of doing a look inspired by a Pinterest makeup look that I've seen and been obsessed with. I have like a whole board of like makeup looks I want to try. So today I thought I'd do something in the spirit of spring. So I'm gonna recreate this look or something similar. I'm very excited. I love yellow. I don't use it enough, but I thought I would do that today. My hair is all like fresh. I thought yellow would be good. So I'm going to see if I can recreate that and then just keep on watching. Okay, so I've done my eyebrows and I've put on my P. Louise eyeshadow base. This is in the shade, I want to say, oh, 0.5. It's probably a little bit light for me, um, but we're going to deal with it. So I've done that. I know we're going to get on with the makeup. I'm so excited to try this. Also a bit nervous. I don't usually wear yellow. Like I said, I like the colour yellow. Don't usually put it on my face. So... I'm going to start off by taking my Zulu palette by Juvia's Place and I'm going to use this yellow in here and I'm going to do one eye on camera and then I'm going to do the other eye off camera and finish everything else up. I'm going to do this eye for you guys. Very excited. As you can tell, do my eyes first. Don't usually do this either. I usually do my base and then my eyes but I've started to like do my eyes first just so I can make it as messy as I want. I don't have to worry about fallout or anything else. So I'm just gonna take this color through the crease of my eye. I want it to be very yellow today. Okay, so it's more orangey in the crease, but I'm gonna put yellow through it first. Nice and yellow. I love it, I love it, love it, love it. I'm just going to take a clean brush and I'm just going to buff out the edge of that. So the next shade I'm going to go in with is the orange shade from the same palette. And I'm going to tap that into the crease a bit more. And then I'm just going to blend out that edge again with the cleanish brush. It's still got a bit of yellow on it where I blended out before. But just because I don't want to drag the orange too high up my eye. Okay, so now I'm going to cut the crease. I actually really enjoy cutting the crease and just making a really big eye space to put the yellow on. So I'm gonna take my P. Louise base again, just on the back of my hand. And I'm just gonna take my brush. This is my favorite brush to use. I don't know whether it's the right brush to use. I don't really know what people use. <laughs> I just kind of grabbed it and I was like, this is really good and I've used it ever since. So I'm gonna put a bit of product on my like lash line and I'm going to look up as high up as I can then I know that is where I need to go at least that's how far I need to go with my eyeshadow base to create a cut crease I'm probably going to go a little bit bigger just because I love having a big eyelid space and it just makes it more intense so that when you have your eye open you can still see that eyelid space 
and if you have hooded eyes like me it's the best thing you can do otherwise you just lose all the colour and it just looks too orange that's what I would recommend anyway This is either the best idea I've had or the oh, this is either the best idea I've had or the worst idea. I'm gonna take my Sample Beauty loose pigment. I bought a new one. This is in the shade Bel Air, and it is a gorgeous yellow. It just looks like this. Really nice yellow that I think would look so nice on this eye. So I'm gonna take some of that shadow on this brush. I'm just gonna grab my mirror. I got this gorgeous mirror for my birthday from my brother and my nephews and my sister-in-law. So I'm going to take that and I'm going to start to pack that onto my eye. And this is exactly the reason why I'm doing this before I do my base makeup. And then I'm just going to take that orange shade again and I'm going to blend that into the edge of that yellow. I'm going to take some of that yellow in the pan as well and I'm going to blend that with the orange and the yellow just to blend them together a bit more. So there's gold that goes round the yellow, but I haven't got anything like that. So I'm going to take my eyeshadow sort of base and I'm going to try and do something a bit similar to it just around the eye. We'll see what happens. Okay, that's how it looks. I'm going to go off camera and I'm just going to finish off everything else, do my other eye and then I'll be back and we can have a look at the whole look all together. Okay, so this is the finished look with the yellow orange eyes. I really like how this looks. I have put some eyelashes on and I just put a little bit of orange along the lower lash line and obviously paired it with a nude lip. I always wear a nude lip, just think it goes with everything. But yeah, let me know if you think this looks similar to this eye look. Let me know. And if you did enjoy today's video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up down below. Comment below any other videos you want to see me do, any other, anything else you want to see on this channel, let me know. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss my upcoming videos. I am uploading on a Monday, Wednesday and a Friday at 7pm, so if you don't want to miss them, then subscribe but i hope you guys have an amazing day or evening whatever time it is that you're watching this and i will see you in my next video bye guys